Hello everybody, it's Tom and Jerry Fan 64 here. It's now time to do a movie review to the this is I'm it's time to do a movie review to the fifth Jason Bourne movie called Jason Bourne. This movie I finally rewatched and I, I I regret not liking this movie when I first watched it. This movie I did find on, on Blu-ray for $4.99 at the Goodwill in Bend, Oregon, back when I used to live with my mom, but I didn't get it. I will get the movie on DVD, though. So now, this is this was the only Jason Bourne movie I haven't reviewed on my channel. I reviewed the old, the Bourne Identity, the Bourne Supremacy, the Bourne Ultimatum, and the Bourne Legacy, but I haven't reviewed this one. I think I might have reviewed this movie on my... Tom and J my my my, ori my original Travis the Movie Buff account, but I deleted it for personal reasons that I don't feel like talking about. Well, basically, the reason why I deleted my Travis the Movie Buff account because I because m my videos had way too much cussing in it, and there was way too much video. There's way too many videos of me raging, like when I did a rant on Battlefield Earth, which I actually haven't seen that movie. I re I regret making that video because. I went to, I feel like I went too far with the cuss words, so that's the reason why I deleted my account, because there's too many videos I wasn't proud of. Like I I've been I cussed too much in my videos and I got too angry. And that's why when I made this channel Tom and Jerry Fan 64, there's not gonna be any angry videos. I'm gonna make sure that I don't yell or or anything. So that's the reason why I, I hope you guys understand. That's the reason why I deleted my Tom and Jerry, my Tom, my Travis and Movie Buff account. But anyways, we're not here to talk about that. This movie, Jason Bourne: The Bourne Five. A lot of people didn't like this movie. I know, um, I know that um Lee from the Drum Dums. And if you haven't checked out the Lee from the Drum Dums, I highly I mentioned him in the previous video, in, in the Bourne Legacy movie review yesterday. If you guys haven't checked out Lee from the Drum Dums. I highly recommend you check out that channel and tell them that Tyler, that Tom and Jerry fan sixty four sent you. Drum Dums is, does so many great videos. He did a video. My one of my favorite videos of Drum Dums is the one where he did a collab with Durant Cinema. So yeah, I'm gonna check and see if Lee from the Drum Dums has a Facebook page so I can send him a, send him a friend request. But we'll see. So this movie, Jason Bourne Five, is not a bad movie in my opinion. I I used to despise this movie. Kind of like when I used to despise um, X Men Apocalypse, and I, but I actually like that movie nowadays. And I and I also used to despise the movie Jurassic World: Fallen Kingdom, but now I enjoy that movie after rewatching it. So yeah, I'm gonna give the fifth Jason Bourne movie. I'm hoping they make another one. So yeah, I heard rumors that Matt Damon is open to starring with Jeremy Renner. I hope that Matt Damon stars. I hope they. I hope. That in if they make a new Jason Bourne, I hope that they it can have both Matt Damon and Jeremy Renner. Because like I said in my review to the Bourne Legacy of one of my other movie reviews of the Bourne movies, that I I think Matt Damon and Matt Damon and Jeremy Renner working together would be a hell of a com an acting combo, honestly. So yeah, I'm gonna give the movie this movie Jason Bourne is my least my second to least favorite in the series. It is my least favorite in the series still. But I really enjoyed this movie. I thought the action sequences were really good. But I think... I don't like... The action sequences aren't as good as the one from The Bourne Legacy or the first three. So pro before I end this video, I'm going to give a ranking. My ranking of The Bourne films goes... The, the Bourne Ultimatum, then The Bourne Identity, then The Bourne Supremacy, then The Bourne Legacy, and then Jason Bourne. So yeah... This one I didn't like as much as the first three Bourne movies with Matt Damon, but I still really enjoyed this movie a lot. So yeah, I'm going to give the movie Jason Bourne a 7 out of 10 stars, and I'm going to give it a C. C+. Plus. It's not a bad movie. I think if you're a fan of the other Bourne movies, I recommend this one. But if you're not a fan of the Bourne movies, I don't think you'll like this one. But I did like the addition of Tommy Lee Jones in this movie. And I also liked Vincent Castle in this movie, who played the villain, the, um, analyst? The asset, excuse me. The asset. So yeah, that is it for my review to the, to the movie Jason Bourne, which I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're generous enough, please consider leaving a like on this video and subscribe, plus it really helps out. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye everybody, adios, have a good day, peace out.